This is like the epitome of a city folk. City slickers. How spectacular is this place? Holy moly. Wow. Look at that crazy. beautiful white horse. I'm Grant. Hi, nice Kendall. Nice to meet you. We're the owner. Hi, Kendall. This is so amazing. Oh, oh Chris. OK. What a beautiful horse. This is Freckles. This is Freckles. Hi, Freckles. He's the CEO. Yeah, he's the this CEO of the ranch. Well, we have a exciting. fun little adventure for you lined up. OK. We're ready. A cattle drive is where you take cattle and drive them from one part of the land to the other part of the land so they, with horses. Yeah, but what's the point of it? Just so they can like eat the grass over here instead of over here? Well, so it depends where you're going, but some is, yeah, to like graze the property in different areas and some you literally have to go from like state to state. We all really need to work together and like we have no choice. When wild animals are involved, you really need to just get it together. Okay, we're gonna get you all mounted on a horse. And all of the horses are pretty calm and yeah, all that. Yeah, they're absolutely really. These are our best ranch horses. No buckers in the bunch. <laughs> this one's so pretty. Which one for me, Kendall? I what do you mean Kendall? She's not. She knows how to choose them. Hey, if anybody need a thirst quencher, come see me. <laughs> I'm a mobile bar. Do you like to ride long or short? Like in between. Okay, good. Heels down. I... <gasps> oh my gosh. Courtney? Oh my gosh. We literally, I can't ride this. Okay, no, no, no. The We're camera. Up. Stepping out know. here is freaking it out. Oh, scared of the camera? I'm not riding that way. And <laughs> hey, there's my mom. All right, let's go. Going on a cattle drive. Just remember the cowboy ethic. Everybody works together. Yeah! I think we'll succeed in doing a cattle drive. Chloe and Kendall love horses. Corey thinks he's a cowboy. We definitely have to work together to get the cattle to go in the direction that we want. But anything is possible. OK, party's over, guys. Courtney, get these ones. We got a stray. Get that one, get we that got one. Stray. Get the stray. Get it, Chloe. Get, get it. the stray. The Come on, everybody, let's go. Oh, these two are having <laughs> Stop having <laughs> with each other. <laughs> Woo, this is a dirty job. They're making us wear helmets, Jen. But her hair is perfect, okay. Nobody told me you'd be wearing a helmet. If you guys don't want to ride, Jen, you don't have to. No, I'm gonna. Okay, you got it? Oh my god, it's charging at me. Go for it. Oh, oh my dear. Her hair is stopping wet. Okay. I just want to dry their hair and style it. <laughs> okay. Oh boy. Oh, this is. A... Jen? Yes, dude. I don't know. It's a bit more. What? I don't know. You think this is a bad idea? Are you sure I've, you're comfortable? I've ridden a camel before. I know, okay. but I feel like it's not the same. <laughs> Don't worry, I have a good life insurance policy. Oh my God, someone's peeing. Jesus Christ, okay. All right. <laughs> this is a dream come true. It's like a fairy tale, guys. Let's go. <gasps> you guys. Oh, wow, look at that. The sun just came out. This is so amazing right now. What is happening? Dreams do come true, guys. <laughs> Jen looks phenomenal, honestly. You're set to look. I was really <laughs> nervous at first because the horse kind of was freaking out when you first got on. How crazy. I come to Paris all the time and never do things like this. But you, be brave. you honestly so hold your shit together and you're killing it. Cutie. All right, now you're his best friend. Yay! <laughs> There's not much to do in the Hamptons. This is the perfect time to rekindle my love with horseback riding. So you have some experience with the horse and everything yes. like that. OK, good. Let's go, Chloe! I don't think you're supposed to. You don't cheer? Yell because of the horse. Oh. 
So we're just gonna start out on a big circle like this. Perfect. Ooh, oh. nice form. Wow. I definitely am way more comfortable on a horse. It's just something I love. I love animals, and I'm happy I actually have the time now to start this again. She's no joke. I think she's got potential. I feel like her butt gives her extra cushioning. It's a little bit sexual, isn't it? <laughs> she's basically banging that seat. I don't know how comfortable I feel watching this. No. She's riding a horse. But would you ride a man any different? It looks like she's involved. There's no way she's going to want to come back here. Are you here. kidding? I don't think so. So you don't think she's back in the saddle? I know, my sister. Even though this is fun for Chloe to relive her childhood, I'm sure she's not going to be into it for that long. Chloe is definitely fancy schmancy now. Getting all dirty does not sound like her. This will be like a one-time thing. I believe she's going to be a full-blown horseback rider again. I believe that you're wrong. I believe that I'm right. OK. You well. want to make a wager or a gentleman's bet? We can either bet money or bet on something else. Like sexual favors. Really? No. What, were, what are you offering? No, not really. That would have been cool. All right, let's do this. Whoever wins the bet gets to decide who's going to be in the delivery room for this third time around. The last time Courtney and I had a baby, she invites every single person that's in her family, and as you know, there's a lot of them. His head is out. It's usually like a slumber party in there. I'd like to see when this baby comes out without flashes happening and all these other things. Okay, I'm gonna win it. All right, let's see. Any chance of a jump today? Huh? Any chance of a jump? She won't let me tell next time, she said. Oh, I already got a next time. Yeah, be prepared for the next time to not happen. She's coming back. There is no next time. Having that whole Debbie Downer conversation kind of scared me, and I just, it's not worth it. Like, I'm not gonna just put myself in harm's way. Let me uh, entice you a bit. I got something. Hold on. A nice little treat for the horse. I just feel like your girl ruined it for me. She ruins everything. Hold on. Hi, Bun Bun. I think this will get you back in the saddle. What is that? <laughs> The lady. You got this made for me? Don't think I'm not coming in strong. Of course, the lord and the lady. Dude. Wait, you're riding with me? Yeah, if that's what I have to do to get you back in the game, I will do it. It makes me feel really good that even though Scott has never ridden before, he is willing to try because he knows how much I like it and how much I've been talking about it. And I love that. I love that he's willing to try something new. It's fun. And then you got your own custom-made helmet that says the lady. The lady, the lady. I wish it said it here. I want it to go a little bit... Subtle? Inconspicuous. Oh, wow. Word of the day. I saw it on some toilet paper earlier. <laughs> <laughs> You got it going on How now. You doing? Let me tell you. Welcome You're the back. Man. Hey. You're Good the to man. see you. You, you got to take it easy on me. You actually look like such a pro. Stand up and swing your leg over and sit softly on her. That's the hardest look, part. Tina. Yeah, walk around a little bit. That's fine. Small, subtle movements. That's exactly. This is the start of it. Can you feel when you have more control? Not really. Okay. Up, down, up, down. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Okay. <laughs> Uh oh, well, okay. doing. Never in a million years did I think that I'd be getting on a horse. And I gotta tell you, Chloe makes it look a lot easier than it is. I don't feel safe. I don't feel comfortable. Up, down. I think I'd like to just get beat up. It just seems easier. I must really want to win this bet. <laughs> this is gonna up, hurt. Down, up, down. I want to try and get you off the lunge line. What's a lunge line? That's me. Oh, what are you nuts? I'm kind of the training wheels for right now. You right, want me babe? to go without the leash? Yep. What are I'm you, gonna help psychotic? 